Okay, it's coming down to money time, y'all. Tucker kept saying at the All Star game, don't you? When are you gonna put me in the game, man? When? steal all day. Man, I've been doing Big man like you though, you've probably been doing this for a lot of years. Yes sir. And no, that never stops. I mean, you're trying to cut it. never stops. That's fine, brother. That's fine. Which, one, which one do with this pan of meat? You ready? That's ready for something, brother. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, Yeah. 
Oh, that's cool, man. It was a pro uh, sealing that thing up. Chesney's gonna eat that one. No, it gets so rough on the airflow. <laughs> Make sure that they uh, don't put all the fat into one two ounce portion cut. That fat cap really doesn't constitute that much, so he just pulled it off. But it did add some flavor. I guarantee you it made it taste better. Well, yeah, and Steve, this they trim these too. They went full. That's you can't serve this shit right there. <laughs> <laughs> you don't have Duke's mayonnaise on here. You don't have Duke's money, is that here? Never heard of him. Let's go fucking home. <laughs> I'm sorry, do we have a bleeper on the. <laughs> <laughs> no Duke's mayonnaise? You know what Duke's mayonnaise is? I was oh my yes, god. Man, favorite brand. Man. You can't live without it. Y'all do a pig pig and just dip it in the mayonnaise? Yeah. Oh, Duke's mayonnaise bread. Just gotta have it. Just gotta have it. In South Carolina, uh, the Duke's company. Uh, has always uh, been big, and and I gotta admit, I got hooked on it too. <laughs> I'm hooked on it. You know, it's a waste of time for them to put Miracle Whip or something like that in the grocery store. Ain't nobody in South Carolina gonna buy it. No. Oh, there's something. You know what I mean? It'd be nice to do that for tomorrow. <laughs> How hot are y'all holding this? 140. Uh -huh. It helps that fat melt in there a little bit, about 155. This steep. Yeah. Yes, ma'am. What's going on, gentlemen? Not much. Are you trying to your lives or what? Just the chopping set. Y'all are the time of
throw out the stack like this. Now, Brad, when you chop, you're not trying to chop it like mega fine, but you're I, trying to get it fine enough that it's a decent bite in the sandwich. Or, well, we've got, a, we've got some smaller cups here also. Yeah. So it has to be um, pretty fine to fit in a cup. Okay. Because um, we do a couple charities, and you know they do the two ounce cups. Nice. Ooh, look at that pulling apart the there. Hey, them guys from Soul to Earth, they say, we're going to go up there. <laughs> I love them guys. Get them there quick. Gosh. Get them there quick. Man, Drew is going to be a barbecue man. <laughs> barbecue guru. We done spilled pig grease on my leg. <laughs> He's going to be working with Chippendale. Chippendales. Yeah. You're right. Gonna be on the big silver screen with Rene Russo and uh, Rene Zellwinger. He might offer one of them some coffee. Tonight, we going back to blackjack. What are we doing? I don't know, man. Well, we're gonna cook that brisket tonight, right? That's right. We're going to Sam's. We, we get some brisket. I mean, we gonna hang out and do it old, old South Carolina boy style in the middle of the big city. That's right. And that's kind of how. How do you get a little like, rebel yell every now and then? Yeah! Get right, little something like that. Get right in Vegas, man. It's like a once in a life opportunity to hang out, and hanging out in the desert. Two South Carolina boys, just yeah. kicking it. And D money. What I want to know is why was the police knocking on our uh, Man, that was all our room door at 3 a.m. I knew that was up. That was all true. <laughs> I didn't do it. I didn't do it. <laughs> Where'd you get that cleaver? Is that Tandy's? From an antique store. From an antique store? Yep. I couldn't remember the story behind it. Actually, it just depends on how really drunk I am as to what store you get. Yeah. You know what I mean? I believe it. What barbecue sauce you use? Oh, man. <laughs> Friends, if you get your party catered, then you're gonna do enough food for four or five thousand people. This is pretty much what it might look like the process we went through this weekend of uh, how it's prepared. And uh, good. this barbecue uh, good. it's coming out real good. No, I promise you, don't. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Exactly. It's all about what? It's about the love. It's about the love. Barbecue, family, 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 friends, and fun. It's about the love. Remember that little trailer park, Daryl? 
Tra trailer park? Trailer park. We got ideas for places like that. Remember trailer park? Uh, trailer park. Oh, uh, when we were in, uh, when we had the life changing experience there at the trailer in park. In Arizona. Uh, when, I, when I got on the about the bad attitude. Uh, the bad attitude talk. Oh. Wouldn't it be nice if we could, like, just drop off a lane what? smoker there? And, and like, have a community. And, like, six of them little instant cameras. And so, look, you can have the cooker just send us some pictures. I should have called it you. Oh, I made a could you imagine that? Yeah, that would be fun. It wouldn't be fun. It'd be fun for him. Well, it'd be fun to see him have fun. Right. Might touch a light. You know what I mean? Right. right there. Might touch a light. Yeah. I'm yeah, talking about yeah. one of the girls at the bar. Oh. Hey, now. He'll be talking there, but I'm not sure about the other coach. The older guy, the other guy's there, too, if I'm in him, okay? If the older guys there, you would him the greater guy. Mitch is down. Alrighty? How many bucks we got left for cooling? Uh, two. Hey, fill it up. Fill it up. Can I go ahead and put these on there? Yep. I got to fill it up. Keep me going. Keep me going. Because once I stop, we're going to get a drink. It ain't going to be pretty. And I've got... Did you say Purdy? Purdy. It ain't going to be Purdy. And I think everybody should write the Duke's Mayonnaise Company and ask them why. As many visitors as we right, have from South Carolina you, in this fun uh, city. If anything comes up, call me. I don't have any Duke's Mayonnaise out here. What's up with that, Daryl? Uh, well, yes. we're going to have to secede this day from the yeah. nation because uh, yeah, you just can't be in the United States without carrying Duke's Mayonnaise. All right, bye. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, that's right. Our two, our two boys we got running for us, you know? Uh-huh. Let's, let's send them to the store to get some Duke's mayonnaise. There we go. See, see how long yeah. it takes them to get back. I tell you, it would be a trip. They come flying in in a helicopter. And then they got it. I'd go and take all the cops, all the football crap, all the plays. I tell you, they've done that kind of job, though. They have really done a good job. Wonderful job. Did you order Dukes? Yes, I did. Oh, got a little crumpy in there. Duke's mayonnaise. You need Duke's mayonnaise? Yes, sir. You need that for the pork? No, he just they don't sell it around here. They only sell it in South Carolina. No, it's a southern thing. They, they sell it on the street. But I don't think they have a full. Yeah, like it's probably from the Mississippi over. Daryl, I got yours. Well, it's up north now, too. You can go on the